So uh, I found that uh, with the uh, Raspberry Pi with Portstone 4 software on at the moment, um, if you uh, go into uh, Putty into it uh, and um, log in. Now this is the first time uh, I've, I've switched it on and uh, it's come up on the screen uh, as you'd expect and then you can putty it and uh, it comes into this so with this you can then uh, go down to system setup this uh, do you want to start a network connection? Yes. The following networks are available. So I'm going to go for the first one. So uh, yeah, uh, and then uh, type the. Uh, password to get in working okay Wi-Fi configured and then uh, if I uh, then run the uh, IP scanner uh, I think you'll find that the, the uh, Wi-Fi is working so uh, I'll uh, just uh, reboot it back to uh, immediate reboot and that will put it back to the screen uh, so I can get rid of all this and um, oops that's a picture of me and here it goes Now this is connected via the LAN cable, that's why it's stuck on the floor and uh, without the LINE Mini plugged in at the moment. Um, so I'll now disconnect uh, the um, LAN cable and uh, rely on the Wi-Fi. So uh, let's do this for a minute. So the computer, so the uh, Raspberry Pi with ports down four is back on and uh, I've disconnected the network cable and uh, connected the line mini up via the USB uh, uh, extender and uh, right now with the IP scanner here uh, scan and you'll see I've got rather a lot on the uh, network I'm also loading another Raspberry Pi uh, so on here you'll see that this is it Raspberry Pi 3 that is the uh, and just to prove it, uh, I can uh, go over to Putty, go to, uh, I've already got it in, oh, no I haven't, no, don't want 23, no, that's, yeah, that's when it was connected before. Now I need to go to Putty and put in I'll load that but actually it's number three we want three and uh, okay and uh, sure enough there we have it so uh, oops now 
Um, you'll notice that's still there. I now go click and menus come up and the screen's gone blank. So I can now uh, press transmit Is it going to transmit? There we go. So that's using it without the screen. But um, the only thing is, this only works the first time you bring the uh, Pi, uh, the ports down four up from cold. Uh, if you um, do it uh, the second time, if you go off the uh, putty, do something else, come back to putty without turning the uh, ports down four off and on again, it doesn't seem to work. I wonder what happens if I do that. No. So to get it back to uh, touch screen, you'd have to uh, stop transmitting, obviously. Uh, and uh, do as back into the old days, shut down, uh, reboot now. And then hopefully, yes, there we go. And we're back to uh, that. We'll just wait for this to come up. And we now go info. And sure enough, look, we've got an IP address. So that's uh, Portstone 4 with that version of software working with Wi-Fi and the Wi-Fi set up using the uh, putty on Windows.